guys, welcome to today. So today is pretty sad because my chicken mama got beat up. Is that blood on her? Yeah. Oh my god, are you joking? Nope. She's on both sides. Oh my gosh, I didn't even think that that was... Tell them what happened. So, Molly laid that white egg, which is right there. So Molly it laid an egg. It was pretty good because they were all pecking it so hard. So where did she lay it? I don't know, but it was on the ground in the middle, and all of them just started pecking. She was trying to protect her egg, huh? Mm -hmm. Are you okay? Yeah. Well, I don't know. That is terrible, Molly. You do not let people attack you like that. You just walk away, little girl. Right, Sophie? But it's my egg. Sophie spied it out the window. Them attacking her? Yep. So she laid her egg in a different spot. It was laying on the ground instead of in the coop. She seems really scared. Yeah, but I don't think she's broody. I mean, she's young. I don't think she is either. But anyway, you saved the egg, Molly. Good girl. Let's look at her little head. I saw this and I'm like, what's that? Oh, yeah, it's a little it's, sore. It's not, it's not right here. It's on her thing. Oh, and my the God. They it's, really attacked her. It's I'm going to clean it. Side. Why would they do that? We have nice chickens. You go out there and lay down the law. Good morning guys, welcome to today. Today is something special, something new, and something fun. But first we're gonna go and kick some chicken butt, right? Yeah. Should have brought some food out, like some fruit and vegetables, because I feel like they would do better if they had some other other things. So go see if there's any fruit and vegetables. She's scared. She is scared. So I wanted to show you guys little Izzy. You guys might not be able to tell. Oops. You might not be able to tell, but she's actually growing some like nice little feathers over top of all that old yuck. Like she's starting to, she's filling in a teeny tiny bit. And she's get, she's looking a little better. Like those tail feathers, once they come back and her feet feathers. Right, Miss Izzy? Anyway, they all seem okay now. She seems fine. She's a bit scared for a minute. Whoa, did you see that? What kind of rooster are you? What kind of rooster are you that you don't put your girls in line? Let them pick on a girl. You have to be, be a better leader than that. Chicken little. So I had to go back to the crumble for a bit. After we got our chicken, I switched to a medicated feed cucumber. Send Sophie in to get some vegetables, and this is what she came back with. Oh, I can't eat it right out of my hand. Don't pack. Gorgeous, though. Isn't he gorgeous? <laughs> Quick, eat it, eat it. Oh, good girl. <laughs> Look at she's looking better. Her feathers are looking better. Can you guys tell? Sophie's still super upset. It's okay, though. We we will keep an eye on her, Sophie. We'll keep an eye. None of our chickens, like none of the chickens we've ever had have been like aggressive or mean towards each other. They've never like, you know how that happens sometimes. I know it's normal. I know it's a chicken thing. We are a non-herding family. I don't know if you guys understand to the extent that we are a non-physical family. But anyway, <laughs> Sophie's over here lecturing them all. They're like, you don't leave. Leave my girl. <laughs> Anyway, we're headed out, but first I want to show you guys something super cool. Right. How the chickens get, I know how the door gets unlocked to the chickens. How? Chicken Little. I saw him. You did not. I saw him. He ran over there and ran and flew at the door and the door moved a bit. And you that's think that's how the chain thing comes unlocked? Yeah. Because if you push it too much, you can do that. Oh, well we need to fix that, Chicken Little. Yeah, and he's big now. He's like the tallest. He goes, yeah. Oh, plus, Put that in the fridge, Sophie. I made an Easter egg. I dyed it all brown. This is from it being in the coffee too much, so I just dyed it all brown. Coffee. <laughs> you put coffee on our egg? No, it was right there. Yeah, I sat it there for a second. Coffee all so then you rolled the whole thing in at coffee? Yeah. Now mom has to eat that egg. Yeah, now mom has to eat that egg. Or Gabby. <laughs> But that's actually kind of cool though because you I mean, can. Easter egg. Yeah, you can use different things to. See, look, yeah, this. This is from that. coffee. Yeah. Being in it too much. Right, well, that's super cool. Okay, so the coolest thing happened today. 
Today, I discovered that I have my own fan page, you guys. I have my own fan page. Let's see if I can show you guys. So basically, it says day by day, Laura Lover 50. Day by day, Laura Lover 50. Isn't that crazy? Sam, I have my own fan page. Do you have your own fan page? I'm make mine right now. <laughs> Okay, I did not make this one. And look at the picture. Uh, which pair? Gabby and Sophie, Brooklyn and Jacob. Wait a minute. This is my fan page. Why does it say? Oh, this is amazing. Day by day. Vlogs. Love it. I don't know how to do anything on here. You can't do that like that. Um, so anyway, I just want to show them the little... Uh, see post. Go to see post. Then you can like it. Then like it. Okay. Ooh. I've already liked that one. Did you know it was from my fan page? It says day by day fam underscore. <laughs> oh my god. It's not your fan page, mom. Oh. Like about the size. No. Okay. Okay. So, okay. So, just disregard everything. But this girl has 43 followers. And her profile picture says it's a sign. And it has like an older girl that's probably supposed to be me. <laughs> and these are all her posts. She looks actually like younger than you. Well, because I'll be looking young, sister. No. Yeah. No. I'd be looking this young for 50. Like you. <laughs> yeah, that, that does look like me. <laughs> this is me. That's old. I That's love it. Old. Wait, That's come mom. on, show it. Okay, so this is me. This is why it. this is amazing to me. It is amazing to me because out there somewhere, somebody, I guess it's more than one person, has, um, has seen me and listen to me and supports me and I just think that is amazing. I get when people follow the girls and Mom only has like one fan page. Who cares? I'm so excited to have a fan page. Like I think that's beautiful, amazing. You should see what Kaylee's fan page posted today. What did she it's post? It's a meme. It's a meme? Of Kaylee. Is it a good one? Uh, kind of. <laughs> I'm excited. It's I, not like a meme meme. It's just photos right. of her making weird faces. Like I love it. I love when you guys get, like, we are super sarcastic family. So I love when you guys are sarcastic and play and joke with us. Like, it, it's fun for me. You didn't even have Stella back then. I didn't. And look at how fat she was. Now that I have her, she's in good shape. Minus the not in shape part. <laughs> <laughs> Girls are just joking, you guys. Thank you so much, day by day, lover Laura Lover 50. Uh -huh. Pull up your fan pages. This is all about me for one minute. All about me. No, I'm just kidding. You guys, honestly, thank you so much for doing that, though. It, is, <laughs> it means a lot because, yeah, it just means a lot that Ow. that you would take the time out of your day to, to make something so, this so kind hot. and so sweet. I don't think you can see the steam, but it's so hot. It's anyway, hot. Thank you so much. If, you, if all the people that I've ever met in my entire life, if they asked, what is the one thing that Laura always says? Like, I'm talking since I was 30. So for 20 years, everybody will tell you that the thing that I say all the time is, is I want fan pages. It's a sign. I always say it's a sign. Everything, I always am pointing out people to people yeah, what is a yeah. sign. And yeah, the sign yeah. to me is how God communicates to us. And he gives us signs all along the way. And um, it's so super important to me. So this fan page literally took my age, the fact that I love Stella. It took all the things. I like it just was age 20 years younger. Yeah, it's amazing. I'm, I'm we were just trying to eat a fly. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now let's go. Hurry up and eat up your mac and cheese because we are headed out to Look, the best us. place. Still have not left, you guys. We want, I wanted to tell you guys something. I've been meaning to tell you guys this for a long time, but there's something we've been keeping a secret from you guys. This girl has a secret nightlife. She has a secret nightlife that Sam and I are trying to stay on top of. Like, she's a full-time job at night. I was looking for Dad. I didn't know if there was any more upstairs. Yeah, because that makes sense. <laughs> like... I could only see my bedroom. I couldn't see anything else. <laughs> so basically, Sophie is a sleepwalker. Gabby used to be a sleepwalker, but She's Sophie crying. Sophie literally has decided to sleepwalk in the last year, maybe two years, and take it on to a whole nother level. Sam, what happened last night when you woke me up in the middle of the night? What was happening? Sophie went to the bathroom. Then she went all the way downstairs, so I went to go get her, but then she was coming back upstairs, and then instead of going to her bedroom, she went back to the bathroom, so I went to bed, and then she went back downstairs, so I got up again to find out what she was doing, then she went back upstairs and went to her bed. <laughs>
Okay. Did you actually think there was no other upstairs? Like you were trapped at the top of the stairs? There was no other place for you to go? I thought that I was downstairs editing. Oh. So I'm like, I'm gonna go to so the heck something, which I don't know. So we have stories. I mean, handfuls of stories. When I tell Peeing the people, socks. yeah, Sophie's peed on Sam's socks before because, yeah, she was asleep Tore looking for the bathroom. His phone. Yeah, she, she took apart his phone one night because you know that's what you do when everybody else in the whole house. No, is asleep. after you pee on the socks, you have to take apart a phone. Yeah, like she. <laughs> I woke up one night where she was sitting on Gabby's floor put her hand under her bed and was rocking back and forth because she had to pee so bad and Gabby's like, Sophie, what are you doing in my room? Yeah, like, I, I, I peed in my room. Yeah. I don't even remember. She doesn't remember anything. How do you feel about 80,000 people knowing that you peed on Ted's socks? And that, fine, like Ruby. Like, oh, yeah, I've already told everybody in real life, but yeah. Oh God. <laughs> Ruby's like, I will save you, Sophie. Don't be embarrassed. One night, I was walking back to my bedroom after going to the bathroom, and I stepped on Ruby because she was in the middle of my floor. Back when we were dreaming, we were dreaming about all the things we wanted to happen in our life. We wanted to have a horse, even though we didn't know anything about horses. We wanted to have a horse, and we wanted to have a farm. We wanted to have a farm before anything. 20 years we have wanted to have a farm. And when we were younger, and we wanted to have a farm, and we were in the dreaming stage of our life, we used to go to this place. It's called the Farm Show. It's kind of like the Royal Winter Fair, um, except for farm for farms instead of for horses. They have horse stuff there, but basically it's where you go to see all the stuff you could buy and use and need for a farm. There's also a plowing match there. Uh, yeah, we're not really interested in that, but the kids like to see it. Uh, uh, if I can find pictures of us going when they're little, I'll show you guys. There's so much to do there. There's like food. It's on somebody's farm. The farm changes every single year. It's like this big, huge shopping experience for farms. Hopefully and there's halters. Hopefully there's halters and um, for, ponies. for ponies. And yeah, so. We used to go there with all of our dreams in our hearts. We used to compile all the information we needed for when we finally got a farm. And here we are 20 years later, you guys. I want to tell you this story so you guys know that even if it's been five years or 10 years or 15 years or 30 years, do not give up on your dreams because God has a plan and God's timing is impeccable. You will never ever look back and say, geez, I wish I had this farm 20 years ago because all the learning that you need in between when you dream it to when you achieve it are things that need to happen before you can be successful God knows God has a plan God knows what he's doing but anyway today we're going a farm shopping um, we are gonna take you guys with us it's basically every vendor that you could ever imagine um, that you would ever use or need if you had a farm Feet, raindrops falling on the street. I can't recall when I last saw. All right, we are here and it is packed. It is 10 a.m. and it is packed. It's amazing, you guys. I am so excited for you guys to see everything that's happening it's not today. That to where we I are. might not vlog it's that much outside. though, like actually talk to you guys though, because people are already staring at me. Can't remember all the fun, the late night barbecue. Where are you excited to see first? Horse yeah, stuff. Yes. All right. Give me a look. There's corn. Oh, corn. I'm going to be the sunflower. No, I am. Okay, go be the sunflower. I'll be a pumpkin. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. We got Laura the corn, Sophie the pumpkin, and Gabby the sunflower. I'm on a genie This is the children's tent. This is where we used to go. This is. Oh, this is. Yeah, it used to be corn, but now it's grain. 
This is where the girls used to hang out and if I can find it, I'll find a picture of them getting their face painted. I want to go back and go to the very first the very first tent that we passed by. Do you guys want to stay here? No. Come on. Alright, woo! You got me the best sign ever? Oh my gosh. Did you buy it? No, it's free. Oh, I want to get another. Look at I got a bag and it has free gloves and hat. Oh, right there. Princess, Princess Auto. Auto and a fifteen dollar oh, gift. Yeah. I'm gonna go get one of those signs. Oh, they even have Mary Kay here. Alright, so I could share. So apparently this is a massaging insole. Oh my gosh, I feel it. I think Sam needs this. So the nice thing is, it's so thin that it'll go in your whatever, dress, shoes, boots, runners, you okay. name it. How come you didn't hear it? We're going to do both. Alright, so you is it what? like gel that moves around kind no, of? No, gel doesn't move around. That's why I put it in my hair. My hair's not moving. So, uh, so it's like a little liquid. Actually, pop one in the other shoe, go for a little walk. So what size Crocs do you wear? Yeah, you might like these. Guys, we finally got a cow for our farm. Oh. This is our little cow. Oh! Right, this is an insurance company and you get to play the game. I want to play. I want a green bag. I smell food. I want I want the bag. I want to win a bag. Do I need to get green? Yeah, one of the prize <laughs> uh oh, Gabby's got stuck. Ooh. My turn. More than once. Price. Thank you. Sam, did you want something else or do you want another bag? Gabby got sunglasses. Sunglasses. This is lip balm. The lip balm is actually good. I've used Are you gonna give me your bag? No. Oh no, man. I, I really want a bag. I really want. She wants the lip balm. What kind of mother am I? It's the bag or the lip balm? No. Go ahead and take the lip balm. Thank you. The lady gave me a bag because she's so kind. I got sunglasses. <laughs> That's fun. I want black sunglasses. You like it here? You just like it here? Can Sophie I got chips. The evil round feeders. Evil round feeders, yeah. Oh yeah, we'll go look at those after. Wait, I'm not done. I love them. Look, you be looking good in glasses. My ears are kind of like this. My ears lower than this one because my glasses go like that. Mmm. Spicy curd. You like it? Kind of tastes like curd with grass. I like the regular one, yeah. I'd like to get an apple. Good morning, ladies. Hi. You could probably have one. I want a pen. We need pen. For school. You want to go first? I'm going. In. All right, yeah, they'll go. I want. I want that book. Oh, so close, Sophie! Yay! Uh, don't pick that book. I want that book. Oh man! Whoa, girlfriend got two. Got a bag. They had a really cute book. I wanted, but whatever. A little money bag. Sophie wants to milk the cow. All right, go ahead, Sophie. Milk that cow. All right. I actually found a real cow. Oh, I love their faces. Like, cows have the best faces and the ugliest butts. Hey, right, Sophie's gonna rope this little baby cow. You ready? Just try it. Gabby knows. All right, here it goes. Here comes Sophie. Rope that cow. Yep. That's not how, huh? Well, I do it, do it! Okay, here she goes. Here, let me hold your bag. Okay. Ooh, she roped the nose! You roped a cow! You wanna try, Gabby? Sure. You wanna stick her? Roped 
Alright, Gabby's getting ready. She's gonna rope this cow. I did it. Probably. Yeah, you're probably better at it than me. Alright, Gabby. Oh, you can rope. So, I like the white. I want that one. So one of these are gonna be eventually in our future. But I, these are kind of too sporty for us. Like, we want a farm one, not a... Uh, yeah. I, will, I will drive this one. We can get in the back seat. Too. I know, that's what I like. But yeah, not this. This is this is not the one. This is not the one? Nope. Oh, thank God. I see shopping. I see a shopping tent. What? Run to the shopping tent. Maybe to stay away from the clothes. No, oh, I love clothes. <gasps> it's a shoe one. I don't want any more sandals, though. Let's look at... Uh, Oh, these are nice. No, it's the end of the season for Crocs, but they're cute. Oh, well, then shh, walk away from the Crocs. Look. So those are mostly work boots in there. And then these are mostly work clothes. <laughs> Dad's just standing over there by the tractor. Oh, gosh. Now it's happening. He's like, I want one that I can fit in. This is cute, though. The tractor you need so you can sit in it, too. Oh, how do Can I sit here? Yeah, climb up there. I don't know how this works, but... Maybe she just leans into it. I think it's a leaning one. Get up there, try it out. Here, hold my bag. All right, wrap it up. You can buy it. Is this the tractor you need, though? Like, does it have all the stuff that you need it to be? It's big enough to do everything. For real? Yeah. Okay, get a card. I know where these people are. Do you guys like this kind of fencing? Looks better in the camera. Did you get a card? Okay, so this is a draw for a basket. Gabby? Oh, so close. Now that's Sam's new tractor. You gotta be a younger guy to ride in that thing. All right, so, Sophie, you want a bag? We're the queen of bags this day. We all have bags. So they get stick it inside your other bag. Oh, that's a nice bag. That's an insulated. That's one to take camping. All right, Gabby, what are you hoping to win? Ooh, you got a bag. All right, Sam. Let's see, not a bag. We only need. Ooh, you got a keychain. Sucker. <laughs> I take a trade it for a bag. Oh, they're nice. They have a light. All right, so we just got into a big fight at the har at the farm What's show. That? Military stuff. Gabby's freaking out because Sophie took the biggest apple. I said, that's my apple, and touched it, and then Sophie was like, <laughs> well, so you snooze, you lose, sister. This is the uh, Ontario Christian Farmers. What is this? Oh, okay. This is the Fellowship of Christian Farmers. Fellowship of Christian Farmers. And they have five beads. Okay. This is what they mean, okay? So the gold bead represents heaven. The Bible said there's streets in heaven paved with gold. Dark bead represents sin. Sin separates mankind from heaven simply because there is no sin in heaven. Separates us from each other, too. Yes. And we have to look after our sin problem when we're on earth. And we do that through this red bead, which represents when Jesus died. If we believe there was a man by the name of Jesus, that he died for our sins, that God raised him from the dead, and then we ask him to come into our life as our Lord and Savior, he won't only forgive us, but he'll wash us as white as snow, erasing the sin from our life, and opening up the gates of heaven to welcome us in. Amazing, what's the green one for? Well, once we have Jesus in our heart, we've just been introduced to him. Now we want to get to know him. And the green bead represents growing in our relationship with God. Do that by talking to him, that's called prayer. Reading the Bible, getting into a Bible teaching church. Beautiful, we got so much stuff so far. We got all this stuff. Okay, I got a water bottle, I got toothbrushes. Just wait, I got a toothbrush for Jack, and I even got this one that goes over your finger for Jack. Yeah, yeah, I kiss what I got for Finn. The apple! <laughs> yeah, that's the apple Gabby wanted. Finn is, yeah, Finn is a lucky right. boy. Sam, yeah, Dad taught you to fight for what you want, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah, she fought for that apple. All right, so this is the tent that we were looking for. This is called 
I don't even know, but they have everything we need to build the boys' paddock. You guys all know how much we've been looking. They have all the stuff and the rope. This is the man that we've been waiting for all of our lives. Look at this little chicken coop. Open it. Okay, well, we can't get a chicken coop that we can't open. Look, we got these sticks. I don't know what they are, but they're going to be good. Wood on the corner. Oh, I like it. All right. Do you think that's big enough, though? Go in. They have one at their shop. They said that's a little bigger. It's just kind of small. Oh, the nesting boxes. So, yeah. It's, I mean, that's too tiny for us, but it's cute. So, this is an insulated water system. Oh, there's some water. And it's got two sides, so y'all know that this is what we need. This is what we need, right? So, we're just going to have some lunch. But I just want to point out something that I've just noticed. We've got so many free things here today. Everybody is carrying around big, huge bags. And Gabby has nothing. And then I look over I at my this. bag. I, I won these. I, I look over at my bag, and I feel like I feel like somebody's been sneaking stuff into my bag, Gabby. Oh, I don't sneak. I just put stuff in my bag. All right, so Sam got a sausage. An onion rings. An onion rings. I got a sausage. And the girls, Gabby's starving. You know she's starving when she's just sitting there quietly eating away. She got a burger. That burger looks so good. Is it good? A bee was attacking it. A bee was attacking it, so you're trying to scarf it down as fast as you can so no bees can eat your meat. Sophie got a burger. And then she had chocolate pie over there. And an upside down root beer. Does anybody know what upside down root beer is? Root beer that she puts upside down. Every day, don't waste my time on yesterday. I never shy away from a good time. Coming on Friday night, I see my friends and feel alright. There ain't no stopping us from having fun. There ain't no cloud inside. The future is looking bright. Cruising. I don't want to give them too many apples. Hey, Just the big one's mine. We'll give Stella a bite because she wants one. She's like. How can they have no fly masks on? Oh, Dad. Mom, that is one juicy apple. Much. Guys, this is the ginormica apple. Hey! Don't bite me. Look what you did. <laughs> Wait, I wanted to video that. That was funny. Like, I mean, it could have been worse. <laughs> oh, you're such a funny girl. Listen, people are going to start saying you guys have bad ground manners. You don't know how to do stuff. We don't know how to do stuff, so back it up. Pretend you're a polite girl when oh. the camera's on. Oh, look at it. There's Hendrix. Oh, Hendrix does the stairs now. The yeah, he's... Okay, listen. I'm, I'm done. I'm done with apples. You guys ready for lunch? I don't know if that dad gave you lunch. Yeah, he did. Oh, well um, then. Mom, Ooh, you be looking we're chubby. Bring water. Strawberry Finn in. In room. Yeah, let's groom. Down the road, no thought of getting old. Girls are hot. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.